So the name of today's movie is The Craft, 1996. This story is about some girls who look like ordinary people, but they are witches. Witches who can do anything wrong to anyone. So at the beginning of the story, we see the first three girls who were doing black magic. Then we meet the main character of this story, Sarah, who was leaving her city with her dad and stepmom and coming to another city. On the way, Sarah saw a lot of snakes. Anyway, now when she gets home, Sarah goes to her room and keeps a picture of her real mom on the table. Actually, her real mom died as soon as she gave birth to her. Now when Sarah goes to her room in the hall, there is a crazy man who had a snake. He was coming there and scaring Sarah, seeing whom she was completely scared. The next day Sarah goes to her new school, where on the first day she was feeling quite strange. Here in the school, we see those three girls whom we saw doing magic at the beginning of the story. Actually, these three were witches, meaning witches used to do black magic. That's why all the boys here were calling them witches. Then here, one of those three witches, whose name was Nancy, she looks at her calendar and tells her other two friends that today we are going to meet our fourth companion, which will complete our group. When Sarah was sitting in the class, a boy was looking at her very closely because she looked very beautiful. Now there, Nancy's friend notices that Sarah was able to stand the pencil without any support, which means she had some kind of power. She goes to the lab and tries to talk to Nancy Sarah, but she doesn't talk to her because Nancy's clothes and her style looked very strange. After class, Sarah came out and sat down. Then a boy came and sat next to her, whose name was Chris. He was the same boy who was looking at Sarah in the class. She tells Chris about those three witches that they are very strange. Here, after hearing all the things Chris said to Sarah, he says that those three are very dangerous. Those three are called witches. You have to stay away from them. And one of them is said to have a very strange mark on the body. Leaving, Chris tells Sarah to come to his football practice match. When Sarah goes there, Nancy and her other two friends also came there. She first apologizes to Sarah that she did not behave well with her. Then she tells her to go shopping with her. Sarah also agrees with her. On the way, Nancy sees a mark on Sarah's arm, which tells her that Sarah had tried to kill herself. But she doesn't tell her anything about it. These four now come to a shop where they used to get black magic stuff. Here, one of them gives a book to Sarah so that she can secretly keep it in her bag. Meaning, stealing, but doing so, the shopkeeper saw it. She comes to Sarah and tells her that she is a natural witch. Hearing this, Sarah was also very surprised. On the way, Sarah again sees the same crazy man who had caught the snake. Here, Nancy and her two friends save Sarah from him and get that man into an accident with their magic. She had come to a place with Sarah. Here, Nancy's friend says that I know, our fourth companion is Sarah. Our group is complete and now our men in two. We will have to pay attention to us. Menon was such a power, whose worship was done by this witch. And they believe that that power is more powerful than anything else. Here, Nancy asks Sarah if she has ever wished and it has been fulfilled immediately. Sarah tells her, yes. Once I wanted it to rain, then the pipe burst in my room and the second time it happened I wanted to live in peace. After that, I became deaf for three days. I did not hear anything. Now Nancy tells her that we should call men in soul so that he feels that his coming will fill the emptiness inside him and all his troubles will be gone. When she hears these words of Nancy, she was very upset. She leaves from there. She was finding it very strange to live with them. That's why she came to Chris and sat down. Chris tells Sarah to go to his house. On which Sarah, now Chris also felt strange. She also refused and came to her house. The next morning, when Sarah goes to school, Nancy and her friends come to her who came and asked her about the night. Because Chris had spread wrong things against Sarah throughout the school that she was with him at night. After knowing all this, when Sarah goes to Chris, he was not talking to her properly. Chris had changed. There, Nancy's friend when she was practicing swimming there a girl makes fun of her hair. In the hospital, Nancy's second friend who had marks on her body she came to the hospital to get the marks fixed. She was getting her surgery now. There, Nancy's condition was also not good. She used to live with her mom and stepdad. Now her dad, who used to do a lot bad chemical substances. His house's electricity is also cut off because his dad had not paid the electricity bill. It is said that Nancy's condition was very bad. Sarah was also having dreams related to her past while sleeping in her house. Now the next day, Nancy and her friend tell Sarah to go on a trip with them. Sarah also agreed. All four of them came to the jungle. She comes here and mixes her blood drops in wine. This was also a magic of hers. Before drinking this wine, she had thought of a wish with which whatever will be in her heart will be fulfilled. 
That is, whatever her wish will be, it will be fulfilled. Nancy's friend wanted to take revenge from the girl who was making fun of her hair. Sarah wanted to take revenge from Chris. She wanted him to go crazy in her love. Nancy's second friend had a scar on her body. She wanted her scars to heal soon. Whereas Nancy wanted the power of Manon in her. Now after drinking their wine, she gets a lot of butterflies which seemed like a sign of Manon. The next morning when she goes to school, Chris was looking at Sarah. Moreover, he also picks up the books of his friends, on which Chris's friends were making a lot of fun of him. That is, it meant that now Sarah and Nancy stay at the house of their friend who had a scar on her body. Sarah tells all three of them about the magic of the finger. Now all three of them do this magic on their friend. With the help of their fingers, they picked up their friend in the air. As time passed, Sarah also became good friends with Nancy's group. One day, Sarah breaks a girl's hair in the school, Nancy's friend's hair tied with magic. What happens now is that the girl's hair was broken by Sarah. When she swims, the poor girl's hair started to fall off. On the other hand, the friend who had a scar on his body tells Manon to fix those scars. Her wish was also fulfilled. The doctor was also surprised to see her get well. She gets well and goes to school in good clothes, and she likes him. Sarah and Nancy's other two friends were very happy because their wish had been fulfilled. But Nancy was not happy because her wish had not been fulfilled yet, which she wanted to get Manon's power. When Nancy's dad comes home at night, he was beating his mom a lot. Seeing this, Nancy gets very angry. She screams so loudly that her dad had a heart attack. When the ambulance was taking her to the hospital, her dad died on the way. After Nancy's dad's death, an insurance agent came to her house who tells her that her stepfather has left a lot of money for her. Hearing this, Nancy and her mom were very happy because their situation had improved. With this money, she had also bought a very beautiful house. Nancy now calls Sarah and her other two friends to her house and tells them about the new magic in which she could take anyone's form. Here, Sarah also shows them her own magic in which she could change the color of her hair. When Sarah is sleeping in her house at night, Chris comes there who was trapped in her love magic. He came out of his house in the middle of the night. Which tells him that he is not able to think of anything other than that. Sarah does not listen to him and went inside. The next morning she goes to the same shop where she used to mix black magic stuff. She asks the shopkeeper if there is anything that can reverse the magic fix the magic that we have done. The shopkeeper refuses and says that there is no such thing because the magic that you do once cannot be changed again. At the same time, Nancy also buys the book to call the soul from the shop. Now she goes to the shore of the Four Seas where she was going to do magic to call Menon. All of them get together and read the mantras. Suddenly, electricity falls on Nancy. When she wakes up in the morning, she sees that Nancy was walking on the water the soul of Menon had come inside her. Many animals had also died there which Sarah did not like at all because Sarah did not want to kill anyone. When Nancy was driving on the road, she kills all the traffic signals with her power. Sarah was very upset. She did not want Nancy to harm anyone with her magic or harm anyone. At night, Chris calls Sarah who was calling her to meet him. Sarah explains to him a lot but he had gone so crazy in his love that he starts misbehaving with Sarah. Sarah now quickly goes to Nancy and her friend. She goes and tells them that Chris's eyes have turned black. Seeing him, it seems that he is not Chris hearing this. Nancy now quickly goes to Chris who was in a party. Seeing everyone in the party, Nancy was upset because everyone knew about him that he was a witch. Now she had brought Chris to a room and she tries to meet him with Sarah's face. But then Sarah also came there. Here Chris also found out that Nancy is really a witch of black magician. He tells her that you are doing all this because I know you are jealous of Sarah. Hearing this, Nancy got angry. She pushes Chris out of the window which killed him on the spot. Seeing all this, Sarah was blaming herself for all this. After this incident, she becomes very sad. Her dad also tries to take care of her but she wanted to be alone. The next day, she was tying Nancy's picture with a ribbon. She was doing magic so that she could stop Nancy from harming anyone. Sarah sees that Nancy and her friends are coming to attack her in the form of a witch. When she wakes up, it was just a dream. Now she goes to the owner of the shop who had black magic things. She wanted help from that woman. Hearing all this, she takes her to a special place in her shop where she tells her that your mom was also a witch, a magician. Something must have gone wrong with her that woman also tells Sarah to call Manon. When they both do magic together, there was a sudden loud explosion that scares Sarah. She ran home. When she comes home, she sees that her dad and stepmom had also gone to their old city. But the plane in which they were going has a terrible accident in which not a single passenger was left. Hearing all this, 
Sarah was very sad. She was now seeing insects everywhere. At Sarah's house, Nancy and her friends also come who wanted to kill her because she was now in danger for herself. Nancy cuts both of Sarah's wrists from which the phone started ringing. See, Sarah quickly goes to the room. Now here she asks Manon for help. At that time, something started going wrong with Nancy's two friends. One's hair comes off and the other's marks came back. They were scared to see their condition after both of them ran away. Nancy comes alone to Sarah. At that time, Nancy also started seeing snakes and insects everywhere like Sarah. Here, when Nancy attacks Sarah, Sarah also attacks her in response. In this fight, Sarah won because she was more powerful. In the morning, Nancy's friend came to apologize to Sarah because she still had a doubt that Sarah had the power of Manon. When Sarah drops the tree to Nancy, she believes her. Also, Sarah finds out that her dad is also absolutely fine. The news of her death was also a magic of Nancy. At the end of the story, Nancy is shown who had gone completely crazy. All this was happening to her because of Sarah's magic. Actually, Manon had given Sarah her power and Nancy had taken back all her powers from her friends because she was misusing her powers. Nancy was just a Sarah who never wanted to be wrong with anyone. That means she was a good witch, a good magician. And with this, the story of the craft ends here.